Previously, on the Tales of Porkchop. I was told not to do it, and it wasn't even possible. I was determined to leave these forbidden islands and head up the waterfall with my single boat. It wasn't difficult to head up the waterfalls, but then I realized it's impossible to escape. For being stuck in these islands for a couple of months, I'm starting to feel lonely, as if I'm missing someone, and that is poor chop. Either I attempt to escape, or I die trying. But every day, I tend to find new enemies. Yo, oh, yeah, I'm the guy who went up the waterfall. Who are you? You killed my clan. No, no, I didn't. I didn't kill anyone. I didn't kill any clan. Believe me, I didn't do it. What is this girl talking about? She's crazy. Whoa, no way. Um, were you? What? Ah, I wasn't looking there. Gosh. Oh, wow. What happened last night? Whoa, man. No. Not another cage. Oh, wait a minute. I think I know where I'm at. She... A girl hit me and knocked me out. She must have put me in this cage. Wait a second. Be right back. What does she mean she'll be right back? I'm in a cage. Man, you know, people on this island, they have a thing for cages. If they want to trap you, they're going to put you in a cage. This is not my first time in a cage, but luckily I could make my way out. Um, okay. I don't have myself a pickaxe. That's not good. Maybe if I just use a hoe or maybe, what can I make? All right, so I can make myself a hoe, probably a shovel, but then no, a hoe's going to work. Uh, yep, hoe's not going to work. No wonder they tell you not to craft hoes. Oh, man. What am I gonna do, fire charges? Maybe I can make some sort of redstone. Yeah, let's make a redstone freaking device. All right, all right. Maybe if I put some fire charges, it can melt the bars, easy as that. Yeah, I don't think that's a possibility. I don't think that's even possible. It will have to be really, really hot to do that. Probably like the sun. Maybe I have to ask the sun for some help, but it's nighttime. Now, what am I gonna do? Hello? Hello? <sighs> All I hear is my echo. Echo. That totally means no one's around. I don't I haven't seen a single person in between these two mountains. This is stupid. Why do people put people in cages? Like I'm so hungry. Oh, I'm going to die. Die. I wasn't even yelling die. 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 Okay, I'm just going to go to bed. This place is creeping me out. I've been in this cage for like two days? I don't know math, but I'm so hungry. Huh? Pork chop? Oh, I thought I just heard pork chop. It was just a pig. But luckily, I always have that engraved in my mind. My buddy pork chop. I remember when we used to live together. It was the best. <laughs> I can't wait to tell Porkchop! <laughs> you late oh. to your house? Go inside right now! Sorry, I was working very late. I don't care. Okay. Alright, um, excuse me guys. Porkchop, I got the best hey, news! Buddy. How you doing? Dude, Porkchop, I got paid extra today! Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. We're gonna be rolling in though. They gave me extra bread and everything. That's good news, buddy. I know normally they don't do that to me, but I guess today's like a special day or something. And look, I got paid like one gold today instead of like nothing, you know? But here, Porkchop, this is for you. Aw, oh, story van. You shouldn't have, buddy. But, um... Yeah, they just gave me that extra <sighs> poor chap did you eat the last piece of bread that we had for today i did i was starving but i i didn't know what to do poor chap you should have waited i could have made something now we have to wait for the whole weekend and all we have is like one piece of bread but you said we're gonna go fishing <gasps> oh my gosh i totally forgot about it poor chap i'm Don't so worry sorry about it, buddy. no it's your birthday today I wanted to go fishing, but the fishing pole was like super expensive, buddy. It was like literally like freaking 40 gold and I only have like one on me. Don't even sweat it, buddy. I was there this morning before entering work. I actually got to work late, so I was punished. But 
He had so many fishing poles and he didn't want to sell me one for like cheaper than 40 gold. Wait, you said how much? All I have is like five on me, but I could give you more. Oh no, you get out. Ew. Okay, I'll find some other place. Don't even worry about it. We can celebrate next year, like what we did last year. We waited. This sucks. This whole kingdom sucks, pork chop. Even coming home, I saw some weird stuff happen. Whoa, what's going on over here? Hey, peasant, are you hungry? Yeah, I'm pretty hungry. Well, then fetch. And there's no protection from the king. There's no protection from nothing against these guards. I understand. But, Steven, can I ask you something? Yeah, what's up, pork chop? When are we leaving? <sighs> soon, pork chop. Hopefully, very soon. Steven. Uh, who's there? What's going on? Hello? What are you doing inside here? Bounty hunter? Uh, here, let me get you up. Uh. Am I dead? Kid, if you were dead, I wouldn't even be in heaven. Oh no, I'm in the opposite of heaven. No, no, no. Listen, I saw you here. I was looking for you. You haven't been home for three days. I know, I was attacked. Some girl just like hit me and then she left me in a cage, but this time I wasn't able to escape. You have some girl problems, Steven. Back in my day, I had plenty, but you look really skinny. Let's get you back home. Thank you so much. I feel much better now. I'll make you some mushroom soup, but we're out of food. Your crop farm is kinda busted since you haven't been using it. And I've been giving a lot of our food to uh, some neighbors of ours. Neighbors? How long was I gone? We got some new neighbors? Yeah, you were gone for like four days, but they washed up ashore, and uh, I let them inside the house that you made in the back. Since I think you're a nice guy, I thought that's what you would normally do. Yeah, I think I would have done that. But thanks for the help, bounty hunter. Thanks for finding me. I think I could have died out there. No problem. I'll talk to them first thing tomorrow. I'm gonna rest. Make sure to speak to the old man. He looks pretty experienced. I'm gonna go find some mushrooms. All right, I'll do that. Maybe with the help of that old man and kids, we can get out of here. I can't wait.